Karen Chandler is ready to walk down the aisle. Having been with Little People Big World star Matt Rolla for years now, the former farm manager would like her famous boyfriend to put a ring on it. Not that this is news, however. Roloff himself admitted just a few weeks ago that he's gonna propose sometime in 2021. An insider has broken some news to the sun, though, telling this publication that Chandler wants a big, fancy, gigantic and wildly expensive wedding. Karen said they've talked about marriage, but she thinks Matt wouldn't drop any hints of a proposal, it would be a huge surprise, the source explains to this outlet. They are very much in love and it will happen soon, they have been planning for the future for a while now. Chandler allegedly wants a big day with no expense spared, the sun also alleges. There's another aspect to these potential nuptials, too. Would Amy Roloff be invited to her ex-husband's wedding? She and Matt split in 2015 after nearly three decades as husband and wife. They share four kids and remain on amicable enough terms to still start together on Little People Big World. Although clear tension has existed between the exes of late over Amy's eventual decision to sell her stake in the family farm. Oh, and Amy has also accused Matt of cheating in her with Karen back in the day. According to The Sun, the Matt and Karen wedding will be a huge family affair, but Amy would not be invited. That's a big fat no, Karen seriously dislikes her. Chandler has certainly made snide remarks here and there on the aforementioned TLC program. She once outwardly refused to live in the farmhouse that Matt shared with Amy when they were married, for example. There's not even a proposal on the table yet, of course, so this all remains hypothetical. But when the wedding does happen, it would be an unforgettable day, reports The Sun. Karen goes all out and she'd want an extravagant wedding, and Matt likes to spend money so there shouldn't be a problem there. Assuming Little People Big World returns with new episodes, viewers may also receive an invite to the ceremony and reception. Concludes this insider. I think they will televise their engagement, their planning of the wedding, then the day itself. It'll be multiple episodes, possibly even a whole series. That's how it rolls. It's worth remembering in all of this that Amy's engaged to Chris Merrick. She recently made it clear that she'll be getting hitched at some point this year, and she expressed some hesitation herself when it comes to inviting Matt and Karen to the wedding. They're welcome if they'd like to come, Merrick said on air last year, adding. We don't want anyone coming to our wedding out of obligation. The wedding is supposed to be about good friends and close family. I like Matt, I get along with him fine, and Karen, but we're not friends that hang out, we don't do things together. That's fair and understandable. It's hard to really blame Chandler, he has known Amy for many years and used to even work for her for not wanting her potential fiancé's ex-wife around on her big day, you know? We mean, Amy did write in her memoir. Matt and our farm manager, who had been working for us a number of years by then, seemed to have more than just a working relationship or friendship. She added of Karen and Matt. I saw messages, pictures and other things that should not have been shared between people who just worked together and were still married to other people. I was devastated. So doubt Amy would even want to go to the wedding, but we're also pretty sure we have plenty of time to see what happens here. That's it for now, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to stay tuned.